Monk Jonas of Bobbio or Jonas Bobiensis in Latin, also known as Jonas of Susa, Sigusia, now Susa, Italy, c. 600 after 659 AD, was a Columbanian monk and writer of hagiography, among which his Life of Saint Columbanus is notable. In 618, Jonas arrived at the monastery of Bobbio Abbey in the province of Pavia, just three years after the death of its founder Columbanus, and he asserted that he had based his account of the great Irish saint on the testimony of persons who had known him intimately, such as the saint's companions. Jonas was appointed to a position of confidence, probably that of secretary to the abbot Atala died 627 and to his successor Bertulf, whom Jonas accompanied on a journey to Rome in 628. Immediately after his return he moved to Gaul, and his life of Eustace, abbot of Lucoy, died 629, reflects personal acquaintance. Jonas was appealed to by St. Ammon for assistance in his missionary work among the pagans of what is now Belgium and northern France, which occasioned his Vita of St. Vadast or Vaast, the first Frankish bishop of Arras. In fulfilment of a promise made to the black monks of Bobbio during a short return visit to the monastery in 639, he wrote between 640 and 643 his principal work, The Life of St. Columbanus. The work mainly focuses on proper practices of Christianity and the events which occurred in a female monastery related to ye old devil. In 659, when he was sent by the Queen Regent Balthild on a mission to Chalon sur Saône, he was referred to as abbot, though of which monastery it cannot now be determined. During this journey he sojourned for a few days at the monastery of Réome now Moutier's Saint Jean in the Diocese of Langres. To comply with a request made by the monks on this occasion he wrote the life of their founder. The other works of Jonas are Lives of the Abbots Atala and Bertulf of Bobbio, of Abbot Eustace of Lucoy, an abbey founded by Columbanus that retained close personal ties with Bobbio, and of the Abbas Burgundofara or Fara of Evoriac modern Fermudiers. Jonas personally knew Eustace, Atala, and Bertulf. Bede incorporated these lives into his ecclesiastical history, while Flodor turned that of Columbanus into hexameter verse. The Life of Saint Farah is chiefly an account of miraculous events alleged to have occurred during this saint's rule at Evoriac, but Jonas's elaborate and fantastically miraculous account contains nuggets of historical information that throw light upon a poorly documented time. The works of Jonas, exclusive of the Life of Saint Vaast, are printed in Petrologia Latina LXXXVII, 1011 to 88. A better edition by Crush is in Monumenta Germania Historica, Script. R E R Mer 3 406 to 13 505 to 17 I V 61 to 152 Hanover 1896 and 1902. Topic. External links Works, edited by Bruno Crush, MGH Scriptores Rerum Germanicarum in Usum Scholarum, Vol. 37, Hanover, Leipzig 1905 Catholic Encyclopedia 1908, "'Jonas of Bobbio". Christoph Droge "'Jonas von Bobbio Jonas Bobbiensis". In Bots, Friedrich Wilhelm, ed. Biographisch Bibliographisches Kirchenlexikon, BBKL, in German. 3. Herzberg, Bots, Calls. 632-635. ISBN 3-88309-035-2. Philip Schaff, editor. The New Schaff Herzog Encyclopedia of Religious Knowledge, Vol. V. Jonas of Bobbio. Medieval Sourcebook, The Life of St. Columban, by the Monk Jonas Introduction by D. C. Monroe, in translations and reprints. University of Pennsylvania, E. 7, Philadelphia, 1895.